Hi, so I wanted to talk to you today about a little trick called dulse. And this is something that I add almost like salt to a salad or a soup. And it's seaweed, it's a form of seaweed. But what's great about it is it's really high in iodine. So anyone who's, well, a lot of women might as you all know and have heard, it's very important for us, especially as maybe our thyroid starts to uh, fail us a bit as we get older. It happens a lot. There's a little bit of an iodine deficiency in the universe at the moment, along with some other important minerals. And this one's sort of tough because you have to get it out of your diet. So if you're not getting it in your diet, you wind up on thyroid medicine or having to ingest it some other way. Now, I was using sort of straight iodine, Lugol's iodine, which is great also, um, it has a bitter taste, though you can also put it on your skin. See, I just did it because I spilled some. You can put this on your skin, I put it on my kids' skin, especially, you know, with Fukushima, when that came, you wanted to protect your thyroid from radiation as much as you could, so I was, it's a really easy way to dose um, yourself or kids and very safe to just put it on your skin and, and then absorb it in that way. But anyway, this is the hack because this tastes good. And some people even think it tastes like bacon. So it really tastes like salt to me, which I guess is bacony. But um, you just douse it in whatever you want all day long. You can even bring it with you in your in your car, in your purse. Anyway, it's it's great for a couple other reasons too. It's also high in B12, which is ha hard for some vegetarians and vegans to get into their diet because it's pretty much in animal products. So this is great that it's high in B12. It's also high in vitamin A, so it's great for your eyesight. It's high in vitamin six. It's also really high in protein, which is amazing. Like if you actually fillet, you can kind of. There's other ways to cook this. If you got 3.5 ounces in, which is like the size of a small piece of like chicken that you would put on your plate, you're getting over 21 grams of protein. So again, another like vegetarian source of, of protein in this instance. So it's a little bit of a magical thing and a little trick and you can pick it up at your health food store. You can order it on Amazon, of course. I'll put a link to mine down below. Enjoy. Wait, I just wanted to add two things actually. Um, iodine deficiency has been, the link between iodine deficiency and breast cancer has been growing stronger and stronger every day with more and more studies that come out. And actually that, continue, if, the, if you continuously give iodine to um, rats uh, that are prone to mammary tumors, you can cut the breast cancer rate by 2.5 uh, 2.5 fold, so like 250%, which is pretty amazing. Um, and then the other little thing I wanted to say about iodine, which is uh, near and dear to my heart, as you all know, I'm doing some hair, have some hair issues, is that iodine, if you're low in iodine, it can be linked to hair loss, which again is also related to your thyroid, I'm sure. You've heard that if you've got thyroid problems, you might be losing your hair. So it's all related, but another reason to try to keep your iodine levels up.